Hey guys, uh, I bet you're wondering why I'm on the floor. Well, I came up with kind of an idea and uh, I brought it to my coaches and they thought it was kind of cool, so I figured I might make a video out of it. So uh, basically, some students were wondering how they can make their uh, work on their squeeze for the rear naked, rear naked choke squeezes um, without having to choke somebody. Um, you know physically every single time and what my coaches do usually when they're just kind of sitting around they kind of uh eh, I can't really do it because I got a big old gut here and my legs are pretty thick okay uh, but they kind of wrap around and they choke their legs which for me it's really hard so um, I have a foam roller here and basically whenever I feel like it I pretend like it's somebody in front of me. I get a real good deep angle here, and I I do it like like I'm really doing it. So I come in from whatever control here, slide out, and slide in right here, and then I get set, and then I can work my squeeze however I want to. Um, I don't know, just an idea, just another use for a foam roller, and um, you guys might could give me some comments additional ideas of cool things i can do with this thing but yeah sometimes i just sit around here well i work my snaking in from behind put my head on it and squeeze the crap out of it um i could probably scissor more i don't know you know just something i can play around and uh work on so if you like that try it out see what you think and uh if there's something else I could do to work on by myself to get a good squeeze from a rear naked choke, uh, let me know. Uh, I'm always trying to get better at jujitsu, and so there you go. Just an idea. Um, so let me know what you think. Okay, thanks.